All right, welcome back to your channel that you all know and love. And if you don't know it, you need to get to know it so you can love it. Um, I'm getting back in the swing of things, getting back in the swing of things with these videos. The videos have been slowing down a little bit, obviously. You know, you're gonna have your hot moments, you're gonna have your cold moments, but that's part of it. I've been noticing, you know, the comments, the same people who've been commenting. I appreciate it. I appreciate all the love. I appreciate the people that are watching the video all the way through because that definitely, definitely help. But yeah, I don't really have much to say for today. I do got something big planned. If we hit a thousand by the end of of the year dog i got something something planned i got something planned i think it'll be fun i think it'll be pretty cool and then also i have a pretty big video planned in december as well but i'm not gonna i'm not gonna leak anything the most i'm gonna say i'm ordering a gopro today we are reacting to another udy video it's been a minute since we reacted to a udy video Hmm. It's been a minute since we reacted to a UDY video. Is his girlfriend cheating while at work? You know how I be saying, oh, they just my work, my work husband, my work boyfriend. What? Anyway, let's go ahead and get into that video. I really like this chick, but like she kind of does some stuff to me. And I don't know, when you that little bit, it's just like, let's really try so then. Yeah. I all the time. Yeah, I overthink too much, and I've been drinking way too much. It's like, oh, I think no, today we're helping no. Eric test his girlfriend's loyalty. We'll just call her Emily. Are you prepared for the possibility Emily. that she might? Fail That's her it? fake name, Emily. I'm prepared for it just because of what's happened and stuff. So like, there it goes. Our decoy Jarrett will be testing Emily's loyalty by hitting on her. Oh, that's a new. A that's a new guy. She remain loyal, or will she entertain Jarrett's advances? She tells me she wants to be with me and stuff, but like some of the stuff she does, like it doesn't like really like match. I hear you, man. It don't shit don't add up. This is her. She basically looks like the same right now. She's just wearing they got some the beamer. Uh, jeans right now and the sweater, a black sweater. So that is her right there. Our plan was to divide this loyalty test into three. I'm blurry. I'm blurry, man. I see Emily's some. Drop across the street. They're letting me see. Eric. He's left his car behind, and we're gonna start our reconnaissance. Thanks to Eric, we knew that Emily was working, but to make sure that she wasn't on the break or anything, we sent in Leslie to do some reconnaissance. Our plan was very simple. Jarrett would walk into her job, pretend to be a customer, and then get her number. He would then begin communicating with her and eventually invite her over to his big house with his nice cars. The house don't look too big. V8 by turbo, baby. I have never heard somebody say by turbo in my life. Don't you just say twin turbo, a V8 twin turbo, a, tur a twin turbo V8 by turbo, his car bisexual. I mean, ain't nothing wrong with it. It's 2024. You can be what you want to be. I think it should be reversed. I feel like you should ask for her Instagram first because I know she won't give her Instagram because I go through her Instagram. So she's going to say no to that. But then I feel like if you say her number, then she'll be like, okay, because then she could kind of hide it in a way. But... And so what did she okay. usually do when she was working? Did she like walk around or did she like to uh, stop stuff or? No, just, she's usually just in her section. She likes a day. She just works whatever shipment she got and then stocks it up. Just stocks it up it. and yeah. that's it? And, and wherever she works, is there like, is she usually secluded or is there like, is she like right in the middle of everybody? Uh, I mean, I guess if it gets full, then yeah, it's kind of like a little like, okay. but it doesn't what really store is this? Because it's not that big nigga, of a store. Is this store nigga in the stock room in the back? The reason Eric wanted to pull this test specifically at Emily's job was because he's caught her doing some questionable things with her co-workers. Their co-workers, ooh. So you have caught her like talking to other guys? My friend that actually is working right now, he saw, for one guy, he saw that. She, he kissed her on the cheek, I think, and like she was cool with it and stuff. I, I, I let her get, I let her get away with a hug, but it gotta be one of them side hug. It gotta be a side hug. No real contact in this region right here. You put your lips on my woman. I'm gonna cut your shits off. And then of course you gotta hold her accountable too because she was cool with it. What? While she was working? Yeah. Some random. Be for real. No, 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 like, no, no, a coworker. Oh, a coworker. Mm -hmm. And then the other guy, his girlfriend, uh, his girlfriend called me and then showed me messages of them talking back and forth, like kind of flirting and stuff. And then right. apparently at work, they also like kissed and stuff. And like, God and, like, damn it. Uh, oh, damn. So one of your girlfriend's coworkers, girlfriend hit you up telling yeah. you. Wait, what? One of your girlfriend's coworkers, girlfriends hit him up. So that mean, hey, you divide this two for one, my brother. We got two people cheating. Shit. No, this is what's happening. Yeah, because she's the one that saw the messages between them. I didn't know because obviously, like, she hides them and stuff. Like, oh, I, wow. I never, I never, like, I guess, I never really checked through her phone until then. And when you caught her, like, doing this, what happened? Like, did you confront her about it? Did we would, you... like, talk about it and stuff. And, like, I don't know. Like, she, the way she would talk about it, it seemed like she kind of didn't care. No. Or when I came into she the store to, like, kind of confront the guy, too, is like, she was just like, 
I guess she didn't like really care if like I would stay with her or. And other than that time. She didn't care if you would stay with her. If you don't leave that hoe, what are you doing, bro? What are you doing? That's proof in the pudding right there. Leave that hoe where she at, blah, bro. If you don't leave her, her deadbeat job over here stacking shelves at this off brand Kroger, man. Man, f this hoe. Time have you caught her? anything with what? anything else and stuff or what i mean I've, like before like once the relationship was barely new she, like she would message uh, on instagram and stuff but like never like link up with nobody it was just pure messages and stuff but i okay. mean it's kind of hurt too because uh i understand her like i guess her side because her past boyfriend kind of like cheated on her and stuff so like i mean i guess she what that mean what that mean that ain't got shit to do with y'all her past boyfriend cheated that does not mean she has to go cheat on you two wrongs don't make a right this isn't isn't it isn't it multiplication two negatives if you multiply two negatives you get a positive or is that divide i don't know man i god damn it i dropped out should have stayed yeah, should have stayed in school i don't know something like that shit i don't know bro you could say there's trauma there too so how long have you guys been dating him right now it's gonna be a little bit more than a year so like you really like this trauma. girl you really want to the be trauma bit do it's just that I just want her to tell me stuff like be open about her emotions and stuff and like about just everything I want nothing to do fuck you fuck that's what he wants I just don't know what's going on in the story as well too because like I don't know I don't work there no more or she doesn't tell me stuff oh so you guys used to work there together yeah for a good while too. then I ended up leaving got it yeah. okay is that how you met her like yeah, working yeah, there yeah. okay the reason I asked Eric if you really liked and wanted to be with this girl is because there are way too many red flags in this relationship I mean in this a girl lot. she just kissing people a talking lot. to people deleting messages it's too much personally I would have ended things a long time ago i mean the fact that this man has put up with this for Thanks. a year though is crazy i see that as an outsider looking in though like if i really were to put myself in his shoes and in his situation who knows if i'd also be blinded by love i want to say i wouldn't right. be but who knows kudos to him for trying to understand her past and her trauma but that shouldn't i wouldn't be bro like i can i feel like i could really i could tell if you don't give a shit about me if you don't care about me and you don't care about this relationship it's a fuck you, buddy. Justify her behavior. If she wants to do everything that she's doing, fine. Just stay single. Is that her? I mean, hey, uh -oh. who are we to judge? Uh -oh. We're just here to help Eric find some peace of mind. Target you, located. Do you think she's going to pass or you think she's going to fail the test? I mean, I think things have been going a little good for a bit right now, so hopefully she does. Okay. I, th I think she might pass, but if she does, it, yeah, it's, like, it's not like she hasn't hurt me already, so. <laughs> I used to Damn, watch bro. you and Bob. You hey, bitch. Hey, take your ass on. You over here about to open the door and shit. Nigga, you don't take your ass on, bro. You blowing my cover, cuz. What are you doing? She over here pointing. I used to watch you a lot. We're on the prowl right now. Pack that shit up. Get this weak ass Honda Accord out of here. Used to. Oh, yeah. Uh, like a lot. Can we take a quick picture? Oh, yeah, let's do it. Okay. Thank you for Picture. watching. Oh my God. <laughs> okay, all right. Click up and leave, man. Damn. Did she have something going on with her coworker and stuff, or like, was it just like? We're just playing. Uh, We're just that playing. That'd be so fucked up. What if he did that? One day I'm gonna do that in public. I'm just lying. I'm lying. I'm lying. I don't know when I'm gonna get noticed in public. It's not gonna be any time soon. But if I ever got recognized in public, I'd just be a cool thank you. We'll flick up. It depends on how they are, right? It depends on how they are. Kiss on the cheek and like. Don't come up to me on no sketchy like shit, though. Got caught, whatever they were told me, I don't know what could have led up to. Right. But like, I just don't want to be throwing too much business out there. Yeah, no, I feel it. I feel it. You just don't know what might have happened. I guess. Yeah. We we'll talked about stuff like probably like many times, and it's kind of like the same thing over and over. Again. It's just I feel like kind of now she kind of gets it more, but it's still just kind of like the same stuff over. And over. Okay. I just wanted to get it. Yeah. I can't force it on He's it, smiling through the pain, bro. He's she smiling through the me. pain. Yeah. Men always gonna hide their emotions, brother. Y'all gotta stop. To say that to you? Have you given her the opportunity to like have that conversation? Y'all gotta speak up. I've given her an opportunity to tell her like, do you want to be with me or not? She says she wants to, so okay. that's why you keep going. Like, I know it's not. She might say that she want to be with you, but it's probably just so she can like, you know, you probably buying her shit. She probably eat for free. She probably getting taken care of. And that's probably why she's staying with you, bro. She working at this weak ass grocery store, bro. She ain't making enough. You gotta, you gotta do some shit, man. You gotta make some shit. Right. I feel like she could do that with me. Yeah. Eric's right. It isn't easy to tell someone that, but it's necessary. It ain't cool to lead someone on and then tell them you dirty don't want to be with too. them when My you don't know. Honestly, it's well. either yeah, you want to be with them, or no, you don't. Leaving this uncertainty in the middle right. does more harm than good. Did you see right. her, Leslie? I think I did. Yeah. She works in that section yeah. to the left. Okay. Okay. So dairy section to the left. She'll probably come out right now. She's the only girl there. Right? Yeah. I mean, okay. I was there. She's the only girl. I've worked retail. If the men to women ratio is a lot higher, there's gonna be a lot of is trying to talk to that one girl and don't let her ha don't let her look moderately good. They gonna want them a piece, bro. I don't be saying nothing. I just be sitting back and I be just be watching. Let's see, let's 
it's her. We're going, the guy's oh, talking to us. Ooh. Ooh. The customer. Ooh, dude, wait, who's that guy? I think that's <laughs> <laughs> There's already a guy talking to her. <laughs> oh, oh, chill, 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 chill. I'm chill. <laughs> yeah, pretty sure that was a customer, though, so. Hey, man. Chill, oh, chill, chill. It's kind of cute, though. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of cute. That's good camera code. Which iPhone is this? <laughs> I love your priorities, man. <laughs> With Just making fun out of it. I love it. What she looked like, he was now free to enter the store and, and get got her the number. Phase Lexus number one now. was officially in full swing. Phase one, right, here we go. So, how confident are you that she's gonna pass the test? I mean, as long as she just says she has a boyfriend, and then okay. Is this not the same damn denim jean jacket that that one black dude had? The, the nigga that smiled real, real big. They got a wardrobe for him. Everybody got, you know, that's that's probably a common black. It's just black denim. I'm just talking shit. I'm just talking shit. How confident are you that she's gonna pass the test? I mean, as long as she just says she has a boyfriend, and then. And then, okay. Um, tells me about the situation. That's about it. Okay. Because like I mean, that's, if someone comes up to her and just asks her questions, that's all you so, kind of like the guy was doing. Like I don't expect her to tell me that. Like, that's pointless. In the way. I just want like when someone's doing a little extra stuff. That's why I'm like, oh, okay, for sure. Okay. We told them first to like kind of like shop around, make it seem all legit, and then right. he's gonna make his move. <laughs> okay. Don't forget your takis. The last was to discreetly follow Jared around, getting us all at an angle, but not following Talkies. too close as to get caught. After pretending to shop around for a bit, Jared eventually makes his way to the dairy section of the store. <laughs> nice to know that you guys still there. <laughs> Does he got a Takis collab yet? The guy who was talking to Emily was no longer there, but neither was Emily. There was Shit. absolutely no sign of her. It was crickets. The worst case scenario was happening. We had done our reconnaissance, yet somehow things still played out this way. My best guess was she was either in the bathroom taking a leak, in the back grabbing something, or worse, on a break. Thankfully, after waiting for some time, though, she eventually returned. Yeah, I feel like she was probably in the back. Right, she's been. Here we go. Here we this go. Here we go. Talk to me. Talk Excuse to me. me. Talk to me. Hey, can I get your advice on something, please? Okay, this this would be an ad break. All right, so shout out YouTube. Like this big ass meal. What's the best thing over here? What would you get? Like cheeks or anything? Anything. Like. What's your favorite? What are you, this soundtrack what you sucks. Dick. You cook? Okay, so if you was she one of those she's one of those Hispanics with the with that wear the vans all the damn time. She one of them. You know, that's a that's a base model right here. That's a base model Hispanic. You cook? Okay, so if you was cooking, what would you have? Damn, it kinda sounds like she's like not giving him any conversation. Huh? She's not, she's not. Say what up. Okay, that's good. So I mean that's how she usually is. So. Oh, okay, got it. Oh, okay. I know you ain't going through the make ready to make fried rice. No, I said like, I'm trying to go like all out. Like pasta, pasta, bread, shake it. Hell yeah, I'm black. It might just be me, but I don't really feel like Emily's giving Jerry. This nigga black, dude right here black. I feel like he mixed. I feel like he Hispanic and black. I gotta look there at him again. Too much that, conversation. Nah, this could have been due to stress, black. annoyance, or concentration in her job, or like Eric said, maybe she's look at just his like hand. a very quiet nigga, person. You mixed, That's it? nigga. Okay. I'm trying to go all out. Would you pair this with like some uh, wine or what? Yeah. Okay. Garlic bread. Help me out. You're my tour guide now. Excuse me. I have a question. Damn. Bro. Right when this test was really about to start and things were going to get good, I'm going to get pulled away by another bro. customer. <laughs> Like, you see I'm with somebody, right? Especially if I'm at work. You see I'm with somebody, I'm talking to a customer. Don't walk up to me asking me shit too, bro. like you need help. Nigga, go find somebody else, bro. I'm occupied. Occupado, occupado. Hold on. She Damn. said, just give me a second. I think someone else asked for help. Real quick. I'll be back. Uh, okay. Honestly, I felt like Jarrett was about to start cooking. Like, I could see where he was taking this thing. And she was with it too. Like, she was down to help him in everything. Like, he was about to bag that number. You can help them Ooh, real quick. Why we get a you, why why we get a crotch zoom, bro? About to bag that number. We need all that, man. Back the camera, back up, bro. I'll be back. Go you got this okay, crotch okay, zoom. Okay. Yeah, you're fine. You're fine. I'm gonna take a lap. Hey, this thing ain't over yet, though. Remember, for phase one, all Jared had to do was just get her number. Right. Chicken Alfredo. Want this? Jared had to wait for a good watch. Chicken Alfredo. You telling me this nigga black? This nigga look like chunks. He has to be mixed. He has to be mixed. Like this. 
Jarrett had a way got a little black in this lady needed help. It's funny. She Let me see his hair. That he used to talk to Emily. Ah, oh, damn. <laughs> she just might be a little bit too busy in there, dude. Uh, oh, but I mean, the way she's kind of responding is just basic and boring. Which is what I tell her is like, just answer simple. Like, mm -hmm. oh, that's good. That's, by, that's good by me. Like, it doesn't have to be like all extra and stuff. Uh -huh. Garbage bread. Hell yeah. Okay. Hell yeah. So essentially, what I'm trying to do right now is I'm trying to put together this whole meal. What about alcohol? What you think? Like liquor? Liquor. Liquor? Liquor. Lick. You got hit? Yeah. Evil? Is that your favorite? I don't drink, but I see people, you know, posting Casamigos. Does, does Casamigos good? I always see people posting Casamigos. Is Casamigos good? I'm not a, I'm not really an alcohol drinker. I don't really get down with alcohol too, too much. That Casamigos really be hitting, or is it just like a kind of a more expensive alcohol so bougie niggas think they buying some? You know what I mean? Good with some garlic bread? I've drank with it before. She literally took it like one cup. That's about it. Damn, we should have We forgot. About this? She smokes. Which one no. she No? She didn't smoke? Uh, hey, uh, you, you supposed to Yeah, she don't do nothing. Let's go. What's your name? Stella, I'm sorry. now I'm sorry. Now I'm sorry. I know I keep pausing, but she said some shit right there. Now you give me a bottle of Stella Rosa wine. Stella Rosa wine, bro. I love wine. I'll sip wine all, not all day. Okay, let's relax. Jared, nice to meet you. Jarrett had finally introduced himself to Emily, okay. and I gotta say, okay. everything up to got this it. point sounded very professional. She also got a name. Like a straight edge. I mean, she doesn't drink, she doesn't smoke. She might have a very good chance at passing this test. But hey, then again, just because you don't drink or smoke doesn't mean you're loyal. Hopefully, she exactly. Is. Don't mean she's not a hoe. Perfect. You say you don't drink? I don't drink. I don't drink. Just a little, but not too. I just don't have fun. Latinas always say that, and then next thing you know, you three drinks in. I know how to drink. All right, all right, all right. So what, how about okay. this? Which one would you drink with me? Ooh, crazy question. Good question, though. Good, crazy question, but a good huh? question. Stella. Stella. That's the one you're gonna grab with me? Yeah. That's the one you're gonna grab with me? Yeah. The black. Which one? Okay. That's it. All right. So I got garlic bread, got some microwavable rice. So when we, we when we gonna eat this together? Ooh, shit. Yeah, I think that's good. Huh? This will be good. Okay. Okay, I don't know if she. Hold on, you do why? Let me get my let me get my word off real quick, nigga. Hold on, we co-hosting this shit right now. I don't know, bro. I don't know. I don't know. That was a that. Mm, mm. She said that'd be good, but like, was she saying like what he had was good, or that she wanted to eat with the nigga? You know what I'm saying? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. That's why we watching it together. That's why we watching it together. She's standing ten toes. She's standing ten toes, but I don't know. A couple of them toes coming up. She's standing probably about six of them things. She probably standing on about six or seven toes right now. Three of them bitches lifted off the ground. I don't know. We gotta see. We gotta see. She didn't hear the question in here or if she just ignored it but she dodged that good well or she oh did hold on maybe maybe i heard it wrong maybe i heard it wrong maybe i'm gaslighting hold on a question here or if she replay it, replay it yeah, I think that's good. huh this will be good okay Okay. okay. I don't and know she if walked she away she's doing good here or if she just ignored but here's the thing though here's the thing though Here's the thing though. Obviously we got the proof that she been talking to other people. Is the old boy that she was talking to, is he on the clock? Is she playing defense because she knows he's at work and she knows there's a possibility of him coming over to her area, her little section, and she don't want to get caught by her coworker. Maybe she don't give a damn about homeboy that's in the car and she just playing defense to protect her ass at work. Right now, we gonna give her a little bit of, little bit of the benefit of the doubt we're gonna give her benefit of the doubt and say that she's doing good right now for old nigga in the car but we don't know that we just gotta keep watching bro but right now we i don't know she i'm on my toes i'm on my toes ignored it but she dodged that good well i'm about to take off but listen i don't want to say thank you i just want to also say cute as you're cute as shit. Why did you say that? You could have said something else, bro. He's not as charismatic as the black dude bro. but the black dude he got too much camera time they know him let me grab your number let me grab your number yeah? I got a girlfriend. I'm teasing. I'm messing with you. Is it serious? Yeah. Yeah? She doing good. Well, let me grab your Instagram at least. You yeah! I asked one more time. We'll grab it. No? 
All right, well. Ten times, ten times. Started. All right, bet. She did good. She did good. But maybe she just wasn't feeling him though. But here's the thing though, bro. She got we got proof that the nigga was she was cheap. She was talking to other people. So what is that about? You see the bar at the bottom of the screen. There's plenty of game left. Plenty of game left. Something gotta shake. Oh, he's smiling. Like, just oh. like that, Emily turns down oh. her decoy. She doesn't give out her number. She doesn't give out her IG, which means yeah. that she doesn't let us go into a phase two. Yikes. I'm gonna put this Isn't that back. good though? <laughs> I mean, that's good enough for me. It's just that I feel like, I don't know. I feel like if we would have done this in the beginning of our relationship, it probably would have been different. Different. Ooh, okay. All these dudes, uh, they uh, they keep looking at me, bro. <laughs> yeah. And she, she kept looking at them. I'm like, uh, didn't I tell you? Didn't I tell you? I think she's standing 10 toes down, not because of the nigga in the car, but because of the people on the property, the people who are employed at the establishment, nigga. I'm telling you, I read it like a book, read it like a book, like I'm reading Dr. Seuss, Green Eggs and Ham, Green Eggs and Ham, nigga. She kept looking at what? Did she catch on? I don't know, I don't know. He, he said like something like she kept looking at. I don't, know. I don't know. Emily did pass, but it sounded like both Jared and Eric still showed some reservations. Like, wait, 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 what's going through your mind? What are you thinking? I mean, I don't know. No, I guess the only doubts I would have in my mind is like maybe he wasn't attractive enough for her. But I don't, I don't. <laughs> he wasn't really her type. Maybe. Okay. It's, so it sounds like you still almost. Can we like, call Antonio, please? Trust. UDY, I know you got Antonio. He had a, he had your pin. He pinned at the top of your contacts. Call that nigga up. Call that nigga Antonio. I know at the top of your contacts, it's your mama, your daddy, your grandma. If you got siblings, it's one of them and Antonio. It because there might be someone who she will fi mm -hmm. finds more attractive. Yeah. But so I, it still sounds like you're like kind of like hesitant and not super. Yeah. trusting of her just yeah. yet. I just feel like it just has to be built more because like she's honestly like stuff she does she kind of like broke it Call and uh, stuff like this with her telling me like stuff like oh some guy came up to me call me beautiful and stuff like well they're telling me stuff like that and it kind of builds it back up you know? yeah. like I said there's always gonna be kind of a doubt but it's yeah. just less kind of now. Eric's reservations honestly okay. make sense to me like this guy wanted to keep it going to a phase two I don't think he wanted her to fail I think he just wanted to keep it going to see how she acts he just wants that, that reassurance. He wants that reassurance. Which again, makes sense considering what she's done to him in the past. Right. I'll be nice and put the stuff back. Now let's talk about Jared's reservations because this is where things take a twist. Before we get into it though, let's give this girl some credit. Like she did pass this test, didn't give out her number. Gotta give credit where credit is due. With that nice. out of the way though, Jared would have tell us later that he felt like some male employees were giving him looks. Maybe this was just him being paranoid. Damn, man, he about knocked her fucking booty off. Tell us later that he felt like some male employees were giving him looks. We well, just fucking knocked her, knocked her shit off, man. All, all this goddamn romaine lettuce right here would have been all over the floor. Maybe this was just him being paranoid, but maybe it was true. Maybe just maybe when Emily was distracted or pulled away by the other customer, these guys tipped her off. Maybe these guys noticed Elias suspiciously always trailing Jarrett and they alerted Emily as a courtesy. Maybe they were just trying to look out for her like, hey, these guys are recording a video, be careful. Or maybe they alerted her out of jealousy. I mean, remember guys, the times that Eric caught Emily essentially cheating was with her co-workers. <laughs> for one guy, he kissed her on the cheek, I think, and like she was cool with him. While she was right. working. Right, see, yeah. that's what I'm so saying. No, 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 a co-worker. Oh, a co-worker. Mm -hmm. The other guy, his girlfriend called me and then showed me messages of them talking back and forth, like kind of flirting and stuff. And then- Bro, there's more than one, bro. Like, kissed and stuff, I'm like, Oh, She's damn. the work hoe. It's just She's a the work conspiracy home. theory, right? But looking back at the footage, after Emily helped those customers, she made direct eye contact with the camera multiple times. Something she had- She made direct eye contact with the camera she caught. She caught. She caught then. She knew. Well, y'all caught. She ain't caught. Damn, bruh. I didn't think that was the best idea anyway, bruh. I didn't Anytime think it was the best idea. We just talking to Jared. So it was almost as if she knew it was there now. Either she spotted it or somebody told her. And the fact that Jared said that these guys were all staring Shit. at him and giving him looks and she was looking at them just Shit. makes me suspicious. Yeah. All right, bro, we got to get out of here. <laughs> They're not discreet at all. Look at Look at her. They're both just like leave the store at the same time. Shortly after wrapping up our test, Eric received an interesting text. Wait, hold on. I mean, that's all I can uh -oh. ask for, man, honestly. For right, for right now. She just texted you, literally. Oh, okay, hold oh, on. So a guy complimented me, just letting you know. That's all I can ask for. Hey. She was like, hey. Uh, I can't. I was like, oh, she was speaking to yeah. me. Oh, yeah, yeah. 
She almost folded. Her, her texting you like that, though, is that normal? This is what we talked about literally like Thursday, Friday. Like, okay, okay she's working on it. This, and I guess this is the first time she's done it. Okay. Yeah. yeah so, but I mean, the that's one step in the like, right direction. It's conversations that we've had like long ago. So, like, I don't know why it, ha it took so long just to like. For it to happen right, now. Yeah, right, right, right. Throughout right, the whole relationship, right. I've never, like, even though she's done that stuff, I've never, like, stopped liking her in a way. Like, I think I'm really in deep for her and stuff. It's just. Like, I guess it's stuff that hurts, but it's just more, like, affected, like, my trust for her. Maybe she don't like black guys. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I hate to say My affected, nigga, like, you, my bro. Maybe she don't like You telling me this nigga black? This nigga look like FaZe Ryan. I refuse to believe this nigga black. Guys, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I hate to sound like this, but honestly, Emily sending Eric that text makes me even more suspicious. Again, I hate to sound what? like a conspiracy theorist, but I can't help what? but think that she's trying to what? save face or look good. She caught on or she was tipped off. If all of you guys are out, it's kind of funny, though. Man, and then she walked away, I'm like, Shit. I gotta, like, take a lap, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Honestly, at the end of the day, though, this is all our fault. Like, we should have approached this test differently. We should have ensured Eric a deeper test with a one-on-one, -on -one alone conversation with our decoy. No distractions, no customers, no coworkers. This one was for sure on us. We were just too ambitious with it. Do you think your trust will ever fully come back for her? I mean, as long as she keeps doing, like, good like this, I don't see why there's stuff that I got to doubt for. Okay. Yeah. Well... Yeah. Show her the video, and I'm sure every guy who hits on her, she's gonna think I it's a test. I don't even. <laughs> <laughs> every guy who walks up to her now and compliments her, she's gonna be like, where's, where's Eric? <laughs> she's gonna be like, where's the camera? <laughs> it, well, when I came over, another couple came, and they were like, um, they were asking her for stuff, so it like interrupted. Over another couple came, and they were like, um, they were asking her for stuff, so it like interrupted while I was trying to talk yeah. to her. Yeah. And then I had to like get back in character. But I mean it was it was cool, man. What is it that you said towards the end? I think she was looking at the Oh, oh, the guy workers. Like they like they were like they kept glancing at me. And so I'm like, I, you're flashy, so. I don't know. But they kept look they kept looking at me, she would look at them. So I kinda awkward a little bit. What guy worker was it? The, uh, it was like two guys. One had a hat backwards, I think it was. Then a light skinned dude. But um, but no, almost got it. You're trying, it. To, think, you're trying it. to see. Yeah, man, you're lucky. Uh -oh. That's good. Yeah. 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 No, but I, I was telling him though, like, I just feel like if this energy would have been towards the beginning of the relationship, it would have been. I'm trying to center up on the cam. I mean, it's cool. My like, center. It feels I, good to know, like. Yeah. Now, do you think she's gonna let you know about this? Yeah, she did already. <laughs> oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, she texted him. Oh damn. <laughs> okay. So God complimented, just letting you know. <laughs> Yikes! <laughs> Jeez. Are we good? Yeah, like, the fuck? So, you know, it was a full test. Hey, look. Come on, man. Part <laughs> two with the best. Hey, you know <laughs> Regardless of our reservations and how overly ambitious this test was, I am still glad that Emily passed. Yeah, the right. test is already over, but Emily did the best thing she could possibly do, which is not give out her number or her Instagram. And I wish I could wish these two know them of the best, but unfortunately, they broke up. Nigga, what? They broke up. Now we don't get. Now we don't. Goddamn matter, man. Did he break up with her? Or did she break up with him? If she broke up with him, bro, come on. If she broke up with him, bro, come on. What's up, Eric? How you doing, bro? It's Sergio Uty. Just checking in. How are you and your girl? Hey, what's up, Sergio? Really dope to hear from you, man. Loving the vids. They are bangers. And well, me and her finished, bro. Yep. They didn't break up because of this test. They broke up. Okay, that's good. Because Emily cheated. What up? God. God, bro, I knew it, bro. I, man, God damn it, I knew it. I knew she was a thought. I knew she was a thought, bro. I, man, I knew she was a thought. Hey, bro, Eric, 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 bro. Eric, bro, much prayers to you, bro. Again. Yeah. Converse much. I'm cool sorry. I have two, two guy friends that work there, and they always kind of, like, kept an eye out for stuff. They would tell me, like, oh, she's doing this, she's doing that. But I guess when we're doing the video, right, my friend said he saw one of the coworkers with her, like, doing some stuff. Uh, I ended up getting mad too, and then I ended up going to the store. I was honestly gonna kick his ass, but then I thought about it. I was like, bro, because that was the, 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 the first thing he said when I caught him was like, get out of here, I'm gonna call the cops. And I'm like, bro, I'm not sure if she kept doing stuff with that guy. But then there was this other two that worked there too that I thought were cool, but he ended up like, I guess, talking shit down my back and stuff, like saying, like, oh, why are you? Bro, they were hitting that shit. They're tearing her shit up behind them. About once them damn barn doors close in the back. You know how every grocery store got them big ass doors and they swing open. Bro, she they were they were tearing her shit up, man. Them niggas were probably taking turns. No cap. 
No cap. Fuck that hoe, man. Fuck them niggas too, bro. You with that guy? You deserve better. He's still going. I was like, bro, this was like, this was a bum. She, she would always tell me, like, oh, don't worry about him. Like, you know how girls are. They say, don't worry about him. He's nothing. And then they end up doing some stuff. Like, but then to top it off after, like, I think there was another dude, like, kind of manager. Uh, Okay. Three? Three deep? Three? Three niggas talking to one girl. Bro, that bitch a thought. She a hoe. She a tree. She, bro, she everything, bro. Fuck that, man. I don't play that shit, bro. I don't play that shit, man. I don't play that shit. I hate people that cheat, bro. They nigga, man, niggas do everything but fucking leave, bro. Just leave. Man. I am not going to throw too much business out there. I think you guys get the point. Like I said from the very beginning, if this girl wants to be doing all of this. You do why email me the business. Whatever, I want to know. That's fine. Just stay safe single she's obviously pretty and stuff like obviously other guys try getting at her but it's like it's on her to like obviously not entertain them and stuff she played no defense. She played no goddamn defense. This bitch is out there running up and down the court. She putting up Tony Snell numbers. Zeros cross the fucking board. You just running. You just running around. I hate cheaters. I hate how we had to end it like that, man. I told y'all, bruh, she was looking out. It wasn't because she was protecting Eric in the car, bruh. She was looking out because of the other people that been beating her butt up behind the closed doors when she got them closing shifts. She was looking out for them, bruh. Hey, man, be sure to keep an eye out, bruh. If you see something fishy, address it, bro. Address it. But look, though, I'm I'm gonna head out. I don't got much to say. Like I said, be sure to subscribe, like the videos. Be sure to share the videos too. We gotta get this channel back growing. Keep it, keep the ball rolling. Keep snowballing. I'm trying to get some, keep more and more videos out there. I'm trying to get this video up by tomorrow. But yeah, I'm out.